Hello, my name is Tom Sun. I'm currently the president and the CEO for TPK and also the chairman for Kendu. Today uh, we have looked at the uh, topic of touch in the post PC era. To discuss that topic, we have break down that topic into several elements to examine them. First, we look at the paradigm shift all around us with various technology, various applications coming all around us. After they converge, and uh, what the touch going forward with that. So we look at each market, ma market segment. Then we also look at uh, what's ahead of us to further look not only 2012, and we look at the growth area for to, to between now and 2015. So really exciting to look at the whole coming from, we have discussed the, all the way. We look at the, the output the computing uh, technology. Their uh, growth has been tremendously. Basically, we talk about uh, the currently our cell phone has the capable computing uh, capability of uh, 1969, all the NASA combined the capability. So it's a tremendous uh, computing power for the output. However, our input has been restricted for the keyboard has been with us after it's commercialized for 60 some years. And their mouse after commercialized for 45 years. So for this period of time, the input hasn't had a very, very big innovation because it doesn't really need such innovation. But however, today uh, people are talking about that and also noti no noticed our cell phone only 10% of the usage is based on communication when we are talking on the phone. The other 90%, we are doing all our multimedia, wireless connectivity to, to the wireless internet, and uh, entertainment, multimedia, and uh, we handle mails, handle work, getting the intelligence, our knowledge, and uh, getting, getting entertainment and the phone. We do music, movie, everything on that device. So today, in addition to the 10% of communication, we adding 90% things we ordinary we didn't do. So all of a sudden, with the tremendous computing power, every command we gave to our device, and instant, they give you output. So what's gating? The bottleneck is input device is gating. So today, uh, we can see the touch application already very nicely penetrate in the uh, cell phone area, particularly in the smartphone area. Already this year will be reaching 36%. Going forward, another three years will be 50%. All the phone ship will be equipped with touch with this, with this smartphone. And that size, smartphone itself will be over 1 billion by itself unit. While the total phone will be 2 billion uh, units uh, in, in a few years. Tablet, uh, it's only two and a half years now on the market. Look at the tablet. The tablet's growth is tremendous. This year we forecast 60% growth. Compound growth going forward through 2015 will be 45%. One company, another company study of 49% compound growth. And today, tablet already 100% touched. And uh, I think the next segment to come up is uh, the notebook area. Notebook area current forecast is saying the study show this year is going to be either 4% or 5% based on 3% last year of the penetration of the touch for that segment. Mm -hmm. So I seriously question uh, that segment will be remain at the 4% for this year and 5% for the next year. So I think that will be significantly increased after we have seen the tremendous innovative product have displayed, demonstrated two weeks ago at the Computex. And while we have seen Intel made announcement indicating clearly touch is a game changer and Intel is, is going to be leading uh, touch and making this transition. So we see then the Windows 8 uh, demonstration following uh, that two weeks ago. So all these are gonna be aggregated. We are gonna see the size of the specific UI all the way from three inches to 80 inches, all be the same users uh, interfacing uh, in touch, touch enabled specifically for design for touch. Mm -hmm. So all the devices in the future will be seamlessly synchronized in the stream. That will be very exciting future for the touch. And the touch is very incredible. Thank you.